of the soldier's home. He's a social act, you know, a, a man who kind of stirs up the social life of the mm -hmm. community. He's very interested in that. He welcomes in new people. Uh, his best friend is Philippe, and we've been sitting on the stairs for 10 years, and six months ago, uh, another man joined us. Uh, slightly, oh, a, a bit like a cuckoo in the nest, a bit of a disturber. Uh, Gustav, and so I'm, I'm trying to find a way of sorting him out. What we have is a French play passed through the minds of probably one of the wittiest English playwrights, Tom Stoppard, so it has that kind of elegance of language and aptness of, of choice of words and wonderful little images, and, and then the situation itself is so... It's three elderly men. There's a, ver there's a veracity about what they say. It seems to me, as an old man myself, I can see that this is what an old conversation would be like on a terrace in a French hospital. Uh, it, it's, yeah, it's very amusing, but it's, its humour rises from the situation. It's, it's a comedy of character. I think it's a splendid company. Uh, it's my first opportunity to work with him, but I had worked with Kelly before and some other guises that he has as his theatrical career and admired his integrity, his sense of dedication to the work and his ability to work very hard. And what you have with this young company is a company that, well, not young company, but small company, I suppose. You have the very best of theatre. You have a company that has integrity, that works hard, that provides opportunity for good local acting, and has challenging repertoire, 